Wow! Rainforests have more different animals than the rest of the world combined. And we have to find tiny secret of little monkeys in this place? Hey, don't you like a challenge? Yeah, a challenge me to a popcorn eating contest and I'm in. But this, uh, not so much. Uh, Aviva? What? I think I found them. Yes! Wow, that was easy. Yeah, when you're driving a giant butterfly. Good thing tamarinds are curious. Those are saddleback tamarinds, Jimmy. They have different color patterns that look like a saddle. Love the orange highlights. And a tiger stripe saddle. That's what gives them their name. Wow, tamarinds move around more like squirrels. So that's why they have sharp claw-like fingernails. And no grabby prehensile tail. <laughs> hey, you can't eat that butterfly, cutie. Tamarinds eat lots of things. Fruit, flowers, insects, frogs. So here's the thing. You tamarinds are all really similar. Similar size, diet, habits. So why all the fabulous hairstyles? <gasps> They're off, Jimmy. Come on. Ugh, couldn't he have just answered the question? See anything, Koki? Not yet. Oh, I see a cute little tree climbing hamster, but not a monkey. A tree climbing hamster? Where? Right behind you. Whoa, that's not a hamster. It's a monkey that is the size of a hamster. The smallest monkey in the world, the pygmy marmoset. She's so cute. I like her slick back hair. I'm sending Aviva a scan so she can update our disc to pygmy marmoset power. Great. And Koki, you'll never guess what these little guys eat. I bet I can. It looks like she eats giant trees. Weird. Nope. She just makes holes in the trees. Here, I know a Wildcrats kid in North America who can give you a hint. Hey, hey Chris, Koki, Nolan here. Nolan, where are you? In my grandpa's maple grove. We're making maple syrup. Huh. How do you do that? We put a little hole in the trees with these taps, and then sap drips out into the bucket. Hmm, sap drips out? Yeah, sap is full of sugars and nutrients. It's the liquid plant food that runs through plants just beneath the bark. So it's sap. This little monkey eats sap. <laughs> you got it, Coach. <laughs> Yummy, right? And when our maple sap is cooked, it becomes maple syrup. Thanks, Nolan. Great connection. 